Hello, welcome to the AM57X Satara Processors Training Series Introduction. The AM57X is part of the Satara Processors family, which brings unrivaled integration, scalability, peripherals, and ease of use associated with powerful Satara processor platform. The AM57X processors have a unique heterogeneous architecture that includes ARM Cortex A15 cores, C66X DSPs, programmable real-time units, ARM Cortex M4 cores, and video and graphic accelerators that make the AM57X processors unmatched in their class. Let's start by accessing the AM57X product folder at www.ti.com slash am57x. To access training, click on Tools and Software, and then Support and Community. Under the Training and Videos section, you will find the AM57X Satara Processors Training Series. Another way to access the series directly is to type training.ti.com slash AM57X. The AM57X Satara Processors Training Series consists of three primary sections. The first focuses on the AM57 devices themselves. There's a high-level introduction, a technical deep dive, a look at multimedia and graphics for application development based on video processing or imaging. In addition, there are two training modules focused on the AM57X evaluation module, including an out-of-box video for the AM5728 EVM. In addition, there is a full section on the processor SDK for AM57X Satara processors. This focuses both on the Linux and the RTOS side of the processor SDK. In addition, there is a detailed presentation on application development using processor SDK, as well as a look at industrial software development, OpenCL, and IPC. Finally, there is a section on the Programmable Real-Time Unit, or PRU. There are three building blocks lessons that provide an introduction to the PRU, including hardware and firmware. In addition, there are two lessons here that are programming-based. First covers how to debug the PRU using Code Composer Studio, and the second provides some compiler tips and tricks. Training modules will be added to this series over time, so please bookmark this link and check back for additional training to aid you in your application development. For additional information, please refer to the links on this page. Thank you for your time.